Pennsylvania at a rest stop. I'm gonna say we're halfway there. My mom and I are going to take a rest. Mm. Oh, look at my mom. <laughs> oh. So I was getting a little worried because I hadn't heard from the guy I was picking up stuff from today. Um, but he just gave me a call that they're gonna open up shop and um, help me out today. I was getting so stressed out over the weekend, but it's all working out, so I'm so excited. We got the goods, we got the goods. We got the goods, we got the goods. We got the goods, we got the goods. 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 I'm in the North Fork right now and I'm filming this in the car because my parents are in my room getting ready and I just wanted to catch you guys up a little bit. Yesterday was a really long day. So we left Maryland around, um, I guess it was 7.30 in the morning to pick up the ingredients I was looking for. And honestly, I hadn't gotten confirmation that I could pick up the uh, ingredients until I was on the road. So it was in full faith that I was gonna be cleared to pick up that I left Maryland, because I wasn't really sure. We got to the North Fork maybe around six or seven, probably more like seven, I don't remember. Today is a big day. I start my first batch, batches, we'll see. Full faith in my team. All I've done is strategize and theorize that certain things will work, and now it's putting it all in motion. And I was nervous maybe this weekend for everything, but no longer. It's like today's a day, it's game day, let's get started. Here we go, day one of my dream. I mean, I have so many day ones of, you know, <laughs> there's so many day ones, but <laughs> day one of literally my batch, what I think my first release will be. Oh, okay. Just woke up and I'll head to the distillery now. Start my day's work. I worked with elderflower yesterday and today I'm gonna play with hibiscus. Keep trucking. Next Friday I have a tasting. My investor's coming, so I'm trying to pile on it and get done as much as I can uh, this week. It's a half an hour walk to the distillery. I'll probably pick up food on the way because yesterday I didn't have time to grab lunch, so I'm gonna bring lunch with me so I can work through lunch and get a lot done, but on my way. <laughs> I am back in the lab and I'm about to taste test the grape varietal I picked to work with first with some of the herbs I've been blending to see which complements the grape varietal best. And then I'll double down on that herb so I can iterate on a bigger batch by tomorrow late afternoon. So it's time to pick an herb to focus on and here we go, do a taste test.
still here in the distillery and the lab. I'm actually watching Netflix. Oh, let me go turn that off so you can hear me one second. So I'm finally done with my day. It's about 10 p.m. and I just cleaned uh, as best as I can because um, I'm just gonna come back super early in the morning and messed up all. Anyway, so I mean, cleared a bunch of stuff and now I'm gonna see if there's an Uber. If there's not, I have to walk home. It's about a half an hour walk. It's really windy and cool today, so let's pray there's an Uber. Let's check it out. <laughs> So there are no cars available and I'm currently just mentally preparing for this walk. I <laughs> feel like crying. It's been a long day. All right, I'm gonna go pack up, put on my jacket and we're going on a walk. I should be there by around 10.30, 10.45. 